Hey everyone, it's better, but Shadow Dragon Mecha here. We're gonna play chapter 10 today, Princess Minerva, except it won't be Princess Minerva. Joined here once again by Original Raisins. How are you doing, man, today? Doing quite well. Ready to see everyone's favorite Wyvern Princess <laughs> in this chapter. We're gonna get a new unit. We're gonna get two new units, I think. I don't yes. know. I, I, I've been spoiled on one, unfortunately. Yeah. Well, I actually think everybody got spoiled on it, like, right? Because it <laughs> happened in the other chapter. Yes. I was like, oh no, what a horrible, what a horrible fate. <laughs> yep. Fortunately, the chapter itself is pretty exciting. Uh, we get our first Master Seal. He's somewhere over here. Uh, this hero carries it around. Uh, you also notice it has this Armor Slayer. is shining blue. Enemies have received a new weapon upgrade. Uh, every enemy is now carrying Silver Weapons. Silver Lance Knights over here, uh, like a Silver Sword Calf over here, for example. And if their weapon is not generic Silver Weapon, then it's a Forged Weapon. So Forged Javelins, Forged Effective Weapons. That's going to be uh, a little tricky. I think I think I did the math. Uh, this guy's 25 attacks. I think Rosado, for example, gets one shot again. <laughs> so he didn't no, need no. that promotion. <laughs> He's back to getting one shot, all right. Yes. <laughs> uh, normally, the way I play this chapter is just I keep everyone roughly grouped together uh, in the bottom part. And then we take care of the outside enemies here. Uh, maybe the flyers that come from the main fort. And then we go inside. And then we go on our way to Free Maria. Um, take this treasure on the way there. And just kind of finish the map from there by going out and then going left. It's pretty much just sweeps the entire map. But I thought it'd be a bit more exciting uh, with a bit of a different strategy. Uh, I brought a weird, <laughs> weird champ team. Mm. Uh, I mean, it's mostly staples. I'm bringing Rad because I noticed that I can now that George is dead. I can reclass to Lin. I can reclass Lin to Archer, but I can't reclass her back. So I got to kill a Mermaidon, I think. Oh no! To make that happen. So we're sacrificing Rad somewhere. Uh, I hope no one minds. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to tell Rat though about that. And I'll, you? on that, I know, right? Uh, bring Should Julia. Should have Rutger, like or something. I don't know. No, I don't want to oh, kill okay. Rutger. He's good. Like I actually consider bringing him because these archers are so strong. Like he's like one of the few units who doesn't get wrecked by the sniper. Uh, that's like the main reason I'm bringing Oscar is because he has just enough speed to not get doubled, and you know he doesn't fly or die in one hit or something like that. Uh, the, almost no one else does that. Like Gatry gets doubled. Uh, Lin dies in one hit, uh, Bartre gets doubled, uh, Dorothy gets doubled, uh, Julian gets one shot, I think Marth gets doubled and one, one rounded, so you know, I have to go with something. Uh, Nime for some warp utility, barrier, physic, etc. other things. Uh, obviously gotta bring Rosado to the chapter where he gets his promotion. Um, Peleus, I actually have a good purpose for him this time, but it's not doing save points. And uh, <laughs> Odin Dank, because there's some... Uh, there's some enemy flyers here that I want to take care of, and he has a good bulk. I gave him the Angelic Grove, I have to use him, it's the only way it works. Mm -hmm. What do you think? No, it makes sense. So, I mean, you mentioned the warp staff on Nime. I don't really, I don't really know what that, I mean, I can imagine, I'm sure, but you know, there's a lot of different things you could do with that thing. <laughs> in <laughs> like, in fact. I know, like, um, well, I mean, it looks like X, Y, Y possibilities, right? Like, <laughs> yeah. you know, how many places you can go. <laughs> I'll show you. I'll show. You. Oh wait, we need to make a forge. Hold up, before Maria, before she gets in there, we need to make a forge. Yeah, hold on a minute. Because uh, we got a nice new weapon last chapter that I would like to try forging in the early game. I didn't think we would get it, but we're we have a pole axe, so we can forge a calf effect weapon that's got weapon trial advantage. Oh, so I think with good. three or four might on it, we'll be able to get one shots very easily. And we need some hit on this too because it's kind of inaccurate. How does this look? Seventy-five hit, thirteen might. It's pretty strong, right? Yeah, plus 15 hit, breaking the bank, it's all right, we're fine, we're fine. <laughs> it's kind of Surely we find more money later, right? Yeah, I just got a big or a medium bullion that was worth like 15k, so this is not even everything I have. Pretty decent. All right, what do we call it, though? Hmm. It's a good question, actually. I haven't even thought of this. All right. How do you, how do, what do you name a Polax? We call it Jim. Jim? Jim? Sure, I don't know why. Jim Halbert from The Office. Jim Hal oh, from The Office? Yes. Is there a character called Jim Halbert? Yeah, him Hal Halpert. Oh, Halpert. Okay, Jim. Okay. There you go, Jim Halpert. <laughs> I haven't watched The Office US in so long, but... This, uh, a long time. There's one guy in the... I think the Pokemon TG community whose name is like... Jim... Like, Pokemon Jim Halpert or something. That always makes me laugh. Oh, no. Like, I remember... I think I was like in college. Someone was like, Raisins, you got... I mean, they didn't say Raisins in my name. They're like, you got to watch The Office, right? Yeah. Like, it's exactly your sense of humor. I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll do it. And I watch it. It's like the cringest thing ever. And I'm like, is this how bad, like, my sense of humor is? Like, Yeah, oh, no, The Office has a bad start. It has bad bases. Good growth, though. It's uh, seasons two onwards is roughly where it's good for me. But I don't blame anyone for not sitting through the first couple. Like, it's... It, it is just cringe. It is really just cringe. Uh, okay, so Rosado is going to go up here where his friends are. 
Uh, I think reinforcements start like turn six, so we do we are on a bit of a deadline there. Yeah, there are some reinforcements, and they start up in that like huge camp in the top right. So yeah, yeah. let me take a look at. Let, let, me, let me just open up the map so that we know for sure, right? Yes. Like... Yes. If you would please, thank you. Okay. Uh, let me show you X by Y possibilities. You. Okay. Let's see where it's going. All right, you're gonna wait over here. Turns out Rosado Hell can't yes. do that hero by himself, so we need some chill. Waiting over there. Oh wow. Okay. But uh, Rosado takes some time to get over there, so. Uh, yep, you're gonna wait right there for reinforcements. Uh, the hero can walk on these ledges, but I think they cost four move because you can see uh, it's like he has eight move, so he can go one, two, three, four, and he can go here. He can go here. I think it costs three, I think, because he goes one, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five, one, two, three. He can get on this one, but he can't get on the next one. So I think they cost three move. So which means he can't cross this whole gap in one turn, but he can get on the first ledge here. Yeah, yeah. But not on the second one until well, Rosado is gonna be able to block it. So the idea so is that... Yeah, can too. Yeah. yeah. And we can always send Athena, or Altena, and uh, Har to help out later if we want to. I uh, just made the flyers over there, which I guess is not really what I want, so maybe I shouldn't have put them there yet. Oh, hold I thought up. that was hold the up. plan. Hold up, honestly. hold yeah. up. <laughs> hold up, yeah, I thought that was abort, the plan. Abort. Abort. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> abort. I, I tried to do the warp play, and I sent... Uh, I think I sent Sita up there, and I was like, okay, it's fine. You can 1v1. Yeah. You, you can 1v1 a hero, and then it's like, oh, wait, but you can't <laughs> kill the hero I, and the five guys. So. You know, I wanted to warp turn one to get it out of the way so Nima can do other things, but you know what? I should probably wait on that a little bit. <laughs> I should probably yeah, wait yeah, on that yeah. a little bit. Abort. Yeah, if we send everybody uh, like it, down yeah. to the south and west, then the wyverns also go towards this down here. Yes. Like they, they, they go south. The, so. the closest target, I think, is what they go for. Uh, I, I could reset a deal with that, but I'm just gonna. I think I can do this. Maybe. Can I get? It's still there? gonna be the closest though. Yeah. What I, we can I'm, do is we can just draw like a diagonal line, right? Because, or so like where we're gonna move Pelias, right? Yeah. So let's say he goes like six up. So that'd be here. Yeah. Let's like. Chest. Let's let's draw like a diagonal line, and then because the, these wyverns, there's no like bendy things that they have to negotiate, right? Like it's just which one's closer. So uh, if we move Pelias to his space, they and can't just... go through these walls, though. I don't think because they can't go through the castle walls. Yeah, but like it's still a direct path. Right. Yeah. True. I guess. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I'll go along with it. So he's here. Yeah. So the so, diagonal is like. No, to to the southwest diagonal line. Oh, okay. Hold up. So here. So like this. Yeah, keep I going that way. Knights. Yeah, we need to, like, our other units need to be able to get past that line in order to be closer to the white Oh, Wyverns. okay, so I can't do that. Then. Okay, 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 gotcha, yeah. gotcha. All right. And I guess he can't go there either yet. Okay, so we'll have to hold out, hold him back a little bit, just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Like, just for now, just stand still, or, like, even move away for a little bit. I mean, yeah, they, need to be out of there, they need to be out of there by turn six, or to get wrecked by the reinforcements. True. I mean, like, if if we're going to get the Wyverns to move down here anyway, then we can just warp someone just, like, right above the hero anyway right so oh let, let me let me see about these reinforcements anyway look what turn is it you're right turn six and nine okay okay i'll just move away for now and then we'll see where they go because they, they have to make a choice like turn one so we can get over there next turn we can use two warps to build like it hmm you don't yeah yeah we can valuable. yeah we get like a bunch more in chapter well a bunch more we get one more in chapter 13 right so yeah i think chapter i think Chapter 12, definitely, and then chapter 17x. Okay. There's one in chapter 12, I didn't know. Okay. Okay, that one is Elise. I think we can ignore that, ignore that one. Yeah, she's fine. She doesn't attack you, I'm pretty sure. I think. I don't know. <laughs> I have to it's, find out, I guess. She, she doesn't attack you after you recruit her sister. Or, well, after you recruit Maria, or, uh -huh. you know, Minerva's yeah. sister. Mm. I guess Kirk. I can work more now, I guess. Yeah, so you just get rid of this warp stuff, right? Yeah, yeah basically. Um, okay, so a couple dudes here. Regal Blade doesn't quite one shot. The Plex, the, I mean, the Jim Halpert definitely will. Our new Jim how Oh my goodness, bro. All right, that's some sick stuff. Um, we overforged this bad boy, that's for sure. I mean, I was just preparing it for future chapters. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, we got the chip right here. Hold up. Uh, Marth into Dorothy, maybe? Or other way around, maybe, or...? Yeah, I mean, either or way. Or you want so. that Dorothy EXP? Well, I think I want Dorothy to stay alive. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I forget she has a, uh, they have a javelin. Okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I'll ship with Marth. <laughs> yeah, and then Hart takes like a further one. 
one of the back two ones. And then we got Oscar over here with the glue factor. We'll take another mm -hmm. one. We we even do some uh, trade command yes. stuff, right, for Altana. Actually, Altana has E rank access, never run. Uh, she does have C rank uh, lances, though, so we can take the glue factor off of someone, for example. So we could do, say, uh, take out the bottom one with glue factor, and then trade, trade, or. Because the idea is that Oscar and Altena use it, right? So Altena mm -hmm. can move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yeah. So we need someone to stand in between those two. Like. Just anybody, I don't know. Uh, yeah, oh, someone but has who to, can? They would have to have some move, though. Can Lin? Can Bartray? 1, 2, 3, 4. Or Lin has 7 move. Hold up. 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, Lin can go here. That's not quite enough, but if someone else goes on a spot where the cab was, like Rosado, I think we're good. Yeah, yeah. Lin can go on the deceased cab square as well, so... Yes, okay. So we can do the Marth into Dorothy play. Right? Yeah, it sounds good to me. Okay. Let's send it. Oh, goodbye, Dorothy. Oh, <laughs> I mean... sorry, Dorothy. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, Dorothy. No kill for you. I guess you could chip the other guy for some EXP then. Marth has decreed. Yep. You will so... not get EXP today. Unfortnites. Uh, oh, and now Marth is getting support bonuses. Nice. Lin? Lin with a KO. So oh, Dorothy come on. Plus Lin? Combo? Wombo? The Dorothy and Lin? That ended up working out, because then we still have the glue factor and the... Uh, what's it called? The glue factor and the Jim Halpert. That's right. All free to go. All free to go. All right, let's get it. So now we use Lin. Use the newly forged many Cotties. Yes. Excellent. So sad. Many Kati. Reference to her crit animation? I don't know. I got nothing. <laughs> Jim Halpert. <clears throat> Into Blow what's up. left. Yeah. Continue the Jagan legacy of good weapon ranks equal good combat. Let's go. Into good. Oh my goodness. So based. Uh, please hit though. Thank you. Ooh. Would have been scary if you didn't. Okay. All right, everyone's done. Wow, that was yeah, easy. That was way easier than I tried. Oh, hold on. Yeah. Like, oh my goodness. All right, let's hit Altena as far left as possible to really entice these Drake Knights to go this way. Did they all go southwest? Or? I think everyone did except um, Elise. Okay. So maybe... Let's see, is Elise here yet? Kind of not, kind of is. I think we kind of have to do Marth Warp, unfortunately, to get to Maria. Stop, uh, yeah, it's... Uh... Interfering with our Master Seal plans. So I yeah, we, I, we we could do that. Like run into the fort. The thing is, if we run into the fort, then like we're pretty just safe overall, right? Unless we actually no, it's just faster to stay outside. But we oh, gotta I... get Marth out of the fort at some point, right? Yeah, I guess what we can do is wait a little bit for. Um... Well, actually, what I could do is warp in here instead and open the door from the inside, and then the hero is blocking the way for at least to attack us. Hmm. Although if you kill him, then things get weird again. That's true. And Marth just has, just has the door keys, right? So, uh, Yeah, there's, some, there's a couple in combo, yeah. So we, he could make his own way out. Yes, he could. Yeah, how many in combo? We should probably check before there's we like, ship the warp how many are in combo. Like, wait a minute. There's two. I got one on Rosado. I got three total, so I should have two more. Yeah, I got two remaining. Plus, it's five master keys each. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We should be good on that. So... Can all... Oh, wait, who, who can use master keys? Anybody? Or... Yes, anyone. Okay. It's, they're very... The keys... The master keys and the keys themselves. It doesn't have to be in the person. Which is gotcha. weird, because in FE1, the Master Keys, I think it's what they're called, are basically a lock pitch for, picks for thieves. Yeah, that's what, that's like really what confused me. I was like, what the heck is this item too? <laughs> like, yeah, no, we have, we have the Master Keys, so we're, mm -hmm. we'll be fine. I want to use a Warp this turn, I think. Uh, I guess I'll throw Peleus in there for now. Mm. Start hitting the hero. Can he hit him from inside? No. Nah. Shucks. I really want to do my plan, but I had to abort it. It sucks. I, want, I like my plan. Uh is there a, uh, a Rosado does die to the Armor Knight, I know, right? Like... Yeah, yeah. he survives the hero, though, so we could warp him in there, but then he fights the hero once and he's weakened, so I kind of want to just do that on the turn I kill him. Yeah. Okay. Uh, if we have our Marth play, then I think I think the Marth play should be adequate for this, because, well, no. Hmm. How about I warp Peleus this turn, and then warp Marth next turn, and then Rosado? Sure. Sounds out. good. we got to get through this warp staff at some point, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Peleus can hit this thief. <laughs> Ooh, funny. <laughs> Get in here, Peleus. 
Why Peleus and not say Odin? I guess we need Odin for down here, right? Yeah, because Odin's better against the Flyers, and the Flyers are all here. Gotcha. You're scaring me. Uh, let's get in here. I wonder if Rosado at this point is better off just flying there. I don't think so. I think it too, takes too long. Yeah, I think going through the four bunches would be better for him. Okay. All right. Peleus hit the Thief. Take him out. It should be that. All right, what are these? Okay, oh. Thief runs away. He should be going down. I guess I blocked his way by accident. I did. Okay. Uh, hopefully he still nope. goes his way if I chase him. He's no, not dude. quite in archer range, so if I send someone in, I should be able to grab him. Oh, maybe this is where I use my next warp then. Yeah. <laughs> Just to grab the Thief. Well, we have a free bait unit, right, in red, so, you know. Yeah. Um, our guys are safe. I guess they're kind of safe if I javelin the Thief with someone. Also, like, where's the thief gonna go? Aren't we just gonna warp more people to the north side? Like, okay, we warp, we warp people into the north side and say the thief tries to go north, like, then what? He just gets, he just gets killed there. Like, uh, true, I guess we can let him go for now. Give these people more things to do, that's fair. Okay, I guess I can not chase the thief for once. That does change the way I usually play, that's that's always a good thing. So I guess we'll have Gatry get started on the, on the first armor night. Or we can have Barcha bait him over too. Mm -hmm. Just kill him right away, so we don't get blocked. But I gotta make sure that Peleus isn't blocked away for the thief to get out, or else he might attack Barchi. Oh, sure, yeah. Uh, okay, so that's all good. Mm -hmm. We did we did see the thieves attack in the other chapter, right? Yeah, they did. Okay, what's going on with okay. the flyers here? It's two silver lands, Draco Knights with 14 speed each. Uh, and and their range is like everything, right? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, they double Altena, but not Oscar. And Oscar has 11 defense, so the silver lands will do 16. So Oscar does actually die in two hits. And hard gets doubled. Uh, Rosado takes one hit. What? 26, 27 and 26? Oh, no. I think he, he takes 27, doesn't he? Does he? Uh, no, he doesn't. Never mind. 18, I'm completely no. wrong. Completely wrong. Way off, yeah. Okay. In that case, let's see. So the Pegasus Knight seem like to be roughly a turn behind, and they have two less moves. So the Pegasus Knight will be here next turn with a Javelin. I'm trying to see if I can safely like gang up on them with Dorothy and friends. Hmm. I wish I brought Basilio now. I kind of tried to do a chapter without. Because I can kill one with Odin, one with Dorothy, and then there's only two Pegasus and two Falcon Knights. Hmm. Tricky, 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 tricky. It sounds super easy, yeah. Because there would be. The, pe the Pegasi will just be covering that square. Where can they go, and then where can they attack after they move? Yeah, it's important that the screen's a little bit small for me to notice, so. Uh, they have they move eight tiles from here. Their range basically so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the it's Pegasi a lot will be able to ground, yeah, yeah it's, it is still a lot. So even if the Dragonites move like around here, the Pegasi will still be able to cover that space. So I can't hit the the Dragonites unless they overlap in such a way where Dorothy doesn't die on enemy face. But I don't think there's a case for that because they I think they overlap exactly. Yeah, they overlap diagonally. So there's no space. Oh, actually, oh, you have a javelin. This one has one extra move, so if they move in just the right way, I can kill one on player face with, with Dorothy and another one on enemy face with Dorothy. But if this is where we use Rad, does, will that work? Yeah. How consistent is this? I was thinking about using Rad on the snipers, but this might actually be a case for that. Uh, we'll, we'll bring him along and see if we can put him to use there. I'm considering having Odin warped in a spot where he can enemy face one of the Drake Knights, though. Hmm. That just makes, really, makes things really easy if we do that. Uh, he may right there for it. Um, yeah, but if you can get one, you can get attacked by the other, right? So how do you enemy phase one of them? Unless you like warp at them and then kill them like on player phase. Oh, I could do that too, too, actually. But then he gets uh, ganged upon by the Pegasus Knight. No, what I was thinking yeah, that's is... Yeah, I thought there was a square, but I guess there's not. There, there actually is a square, but it's also in range of the Pegasus Knight. So no, that, that's not an option, actually. You're right. Uh, in that case, I guess we just have to save pointing and pray. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, unless... Is Gatry provide a Unless, wait, hold, what if you what if you warp Odin in a position where you can kill one of the Pegasi, and then you just put Oscar in range of the Wyverns, and then the Pegasi get baited, that Pegasus there gets baited to Odin, and the other Wyverns get baited to Oscar? Um. Okay, let me check out Dark Knight ranges again. Oh yeah, like, say you go this one for example, yeah. Yeah, we can go there, and then the other Pegasus gets baited to attack Oscar. Oh, I love that. That's a good idea. That's a good ass idea. Uh, and Oscar, I guess the idea is that he would only fight one, right? Because they can't both yeah, yeah. the same square. Yeah, he'd use, yeah, he'd use Altena's square. 
Yes. Okay. I like that. Let's do that. Okay. I will we'll probably save point to do that, though, just to make sure it doesn't go wrong. Makes uh, sense. And I guess this means I can use this turn to warp marked, right? Uh, you need to warp out in this turn. Oh, yeah. Right? <laughs> don't yeah. mind me. All right. I'll use Linda's save. I don't think she's doing anything this turn. I agree. And then we'll warp Odin Dank over all the way here somewhere. I was about to ask, actually, what's Elise's range? <laughs> uh, I think she's all the way over here, right? Yeah, I was like, yeah, okay, she's, yeah, yeah, she's, she's, she's way over there. We're fine, gotcha. We're fine, we're fine. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I gotta make sure I'm in range of the Pegasus Knights with the Javelin. That seems to be covered. All right. Odin Warp Hand. <laughs> Get out of here. Like darkness is darker than yours. I like it, I like it. Down fell Pegasus. <laughs> Down. Feels like the most canonically non evil person ever. Down. Uh, does Oscar really live? Like two? 26. Doesn't he die to one? Does he die to one? It's 27 and 26, right? Yes, but he gets doubled, right? No, he doesn't get doubled. He's good. He's good. Okay. Alright, I'll take that. Get out of my way. Oscar, mm -hmm. 27, take 27, 26. Away. Yeah, 50. He, wait, he just barely dies to two, but it's fine. He just won't get attacked by two because of the square. Yes. Okay. Uh, hopefully, I mean, there's no way he covers some success. He doesn't have enough attack to kill, kill with the crit, so... Yeah, no. <laughs> we'll be fine. And then we have a bunch of archery and stuff like that to take care of them. And by a bunch of archery, I mean, we just warped like, one of our fire killers out, but we'll be fine. I mean, that we fire killer just took out two fires this turn, right? So, yes. you know, how bad can it be? Okay. All right, Pelias, stay where you are. You can get attacked by somebody? I don't know. Uh, oh, the Love and Sword Thief could th theoretically attack him. Okay. Oh, I guess he has to rank for that. Yes, you're right. All right, mm -hmm. Thief better not attack Bart right now. Okay, all according to plan. Oh, plan arena. sword hand! 109, 29 damage. <laughs> Who needs the extra 20? Elwin. She has the crit protection skill, right? There you go. I'm sure they do. Oh, let's go. What? He's so good. Magic defense. All right, Ooh. time to not get doubled. We did Great the map on this one. Easy, easy. All right, where's the other one go? All according to plan. I th easy. Think she just moved two tiles. Do you see that? I think she's going to sit yeah. here and do nothing. She just wants to chill out there? I think so, actually. Yeah. Okay, in that case... Uh, She's summoning that. the reinforcements, right? Yep, she sure is. Uh, but this is definitely an annoying spot to... Uh, yeah, I can't do my plan here, unfortunately, it's with her sitting mm -hmm. there. So Pelis is kind of stuck like, vibing here for a while. Are we trying to get Maria this turn? Uh, I was thinking about it, but I can't because uh, Marth is... Yeah, Marth got range. Yeah, hmm. Mm, Shouldn't have fine. done that. I think we'll just, we, just walk. we can just walk there at this point, just vibe. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll be okay. We you need to deal with the snipers. Like night, I guess. Yeah, exactly. We're not in a hurry to do that, though. Uh, Pelis, we know he can 2 kill the thief with fire, so as long as when he appears there, he'll be fine. I, if at some point we open the hallway, the thief just goes south, right? Yeah, hopefully um, we need to move Pelis up a bit so that he can kill the thief before he ever gets to the door, because if he, like, misses, and then the thief gets opens the door to the armor slayer guy... <laughs> oh, yeah, it's a, you're right, that's a bit of an issue. Let's be a little bit proactive there. And yeah, and here it looks like Lin can attack them. I don't think that's a great idea. Even like I was thinking about going Archer, but I couldn't go back to Myrmidon, so I didn't want to do that. Let's go the full HP Draco Knight with Dorothy. Oh, that doesn't even Oko. These guys are tough. Not the Porthia. Yeah, she got the real thing, I guess. Oh boy. All right, uh, I guess I'll weaken with Gatry, or maybe just kill the low health one then, so he's out of the way, and then we have more squares to attack the other one from. Sounds good to me. He's already here. But not for long. <laughs> <laughs> Where's our Worms Lair, actually? Uh, it doesn't work on Dragonites. Fun fact. Okay. Uh, can try to show up. Do we, have a, we have a Lemon Sword on Mark. It's probably... Oh, no, never mind. Oh, it's not a bit. Never mind. I mean, it is two damage. Like, it is know. two damage. How much would the uh, Rapier do? Say four damage. And we get doubled in four. return. Gaming. That's right. Good, good trade. All right. Uh, who doesn't die here? Har? Oh, Har survives. That's good. Oh, that's, yeah, uh, this whole that's time. a solid amount of damage. And then, Where's my Silver X? Uh, where is, it's in Convoy, so we could probably get that out if we want to. It might there be you go. good. Uh, we can the sword and get the Silver Axe out, I guess. Just, there you go, full value. Yep. Two damage. Leaven Sword. 
Thanks, Cannibal. Alright. Say bye to Steelaxe. Say hello to five used Silver Axe. Hey, five's more than zero, right? It's true. But not for long. <laughs> Twelve. Not for long. What? Are you gonna like change math on us? <laughs> I mean, it's gonna break at some point. Ah, true. Uh, I guess we chat. Jesus. Ooh. Wait, what? Ooh. We had this guy the whole time, bro. We <laughs> had this guy the whole time. <laughs> Alright, let everyone else get some crumbs before we just destroy his butt with Rosado. Yeah, holy. Get some nice chip in here. I'm gonna peep closer to the entrance so we can get the archers. Okay, it looks like... Yeah, we do need to pivot yeah. to that game plan at some point, right? Mm -hmm. okay, I'm gonna try to do Gatry here because I would like him to get a level. <clears throat> yeah! Yeah! I'm, I'm confident Rosado will get enough levels. Yeah, this. we'll be fine. I mean, he's kind of gotten enough already, right? <laughs> kind of. Well, actually, no, he's not level 20. We can always keep going. <laughs> Alright, heal bar tray so we can get another armor knight out of the way for us. Uh, did I mention I want to buy a generic hammer so he doesn't have to do this all the time? I think I did mention that. This one? Mm -hmm. Eight can openers is not enough. Yep. Okay. Julian, Rad, I guess Link can go indoors instead of outdoors. Yeah. Oh, wait, turns where we at? Or four. Okay, we got a couple turns left. I yeah. I mean, Rosado is probably useful for killing archers when they come to us. So let's fly him inside. We can even use uh, not a ton of units, but like one unit, maybe Oscar for like baiting units over the wall, right? Oh, true. We can have Odin fight some of them over the wall as well. Because he's over here. You know what? That seems like that should really helpful. Simple. I think the sniper will try to kill him if we can, but they don't that's, a, that's the thing is, oh, they don't kill him one hit. Ooh. Uh, we just need to not physical. crit on the counter, right? Yeah, we just use fire or something. Yeah, we need to foam or something. I don't have foil foams in convoy, but I do have uh, new main here. Uh, did you just... Huh. Not attack? Interesting choice. Merciful Armanite? Okay, okay, all right. Cool. Don't attack, that's fine. Physic number two. Taint physic. Three. There we go. We can spam the one we got now. Yep. Uh, okay, Thief is in range now. I guess Thief is in like the jungle basically. Like. Yeah, that's not a good jungle for Peleus to be. So let's stay out for one more turn. Yeah, so I guess we physic Odin with Nima this turn? I think so. I think Odin actually lives, even the sniper, even without the physic, but it we can do it though. too. 23 times 2 is 26. Oh, Almost he doubles, defense. right? Okay. Yeah, now uh, the archers don't double, but I think they will. I don't actually know if they go for kills first in this game, I forgot. But it, it probably would be prudent to just heal him anyway, because even if he doesn't, if he, if he would live an archer, they attack first. We still want him to have like more HP next turn and Nima to be able to do something else. Like, That's who else right. Is damaged? Yeah. What else is Nima gonna do? You're right. Mm -hmm. Not a question I hear myself asking often. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so if we can isolate the sniper this way, that would be really good. So let's go here with Odin and then Thunder. 19. 16 damage. I would kill with a crit, so let's just not crit fire. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, Oscar even if all we do is. The wall. Oh, true. Oscar fights too. Yeah. Yeah, easy, easy. All right. And doesn't get doubled. Wait yeah. a minute. This unit's kind of good. I was like Hogwarts. slandering him all game long, but Hogwarts. no, he's kind of good. All right. Do we go through the outside with Marth? Is that now better? I mean, you have to do uh, the player guy somehow. This point. Uh, probably actually still better to double back and like just go through the fort the same way everyone else is going. All right. Let's go that way with the rest of the friends. They can help chip. I guess rad. If the armor knight is not moving, then I guess I can get an archer over here this way. Uh, maybe he'll go for a kill if I bait him. Like, let's see if he goes for a kill. <laughs> yeah. It'll be quite amusing. Do we do we actually go for that can opener? Because the can opener only gets attacked by one archer, right? Oh, you mean like putting him here? Uh, no, Bartray like literally player face attacking oh, the armor knight. Hmm. Oh, he's in range of two this way. Uh, one of them. No, he's in range of one. If he goes from the east. No. Far chain? Oh, wait, what? Show me the this range in this range. Oh, oh, you're so right. Okay, yeah, I was wrong. <laughs> it would be nice, but uh, I think he survives getting doubled once. So if we isolate one sniper, I think we're good to go for that operation. But I don't think we are. All right, Rosado, ready to get some more kills here. We got tree double back. And ult here. Get all the units in here. Ready to take on some archers. Part B. Oh, he goes for kills. <laughs> he goes for kills. <laughs> Bye, Rad. <laughs> See ya. No. See, I told you guys I didn't want to kill off my own units. 
Look, if, if Rad's bringing a Shadow Dragon hack, oh, he's probably fine with killing off units, right? Oh, Odin two shots the Sniper with... Oh, this is Archer, never mind. <laughs> Archer, yeah, no. It would have been so cool. Alright. Uh, the Sniper stays isolated. We can maybe surround him with... A... Oh, oh, they move, they move like that. Oh, that's that's smart. That's smart. Okay, well played, game. Well played. Well, now... Well, now they move at us, right? Yeah, I don't know where to go from here. Let's see if we can get a kill on Lin here, because those opportunities are rare. Uh, we only have 85 Oof. hit here. Do we chip with the Rosado Javelin? Yes. Impossible, 22, I know, but you know. Find a 20 something. Yeah, that should be fine. All right, down for Rosado chip. Just don't crit, whatever you do. <laughs> 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 All the stocks are mine. You know what, Rosado EXP? It was all, it was my agenda, <laughs> right? Like... It's fine. Okay, there's one archer we can easily isolate. That's also the easy one to kill. I wonder if we can kill the other one with Excalibur. I think so. Yeah, okay. I think we can like leave this one alone for a second. Excalibur the top one? Or Swordhand the top one? Excuse me, Odin, I'm sorry. Or That kills the other one too, though, right? Yeah, what if we... Yeah, maybe kill that one. And then heal Odin. Can we kill that one with Javelin? No way, right? That's too weak. 18? No, we can't. Uh, unless Bartray gets involved. It's a little risky. Well, that's spicy. It's very spicy. Or a warp, but we don't want to heal Odin, so I don't think that's happening. What if yeah. we just like let the archers move to the east? Like, What if we just disengage from this group with Odin and Oscar, let the archers move to the east, and then like jump on them inside the fort? Yeah, I think... Because they're going to move east, right? I think it'd be Unless a mistake to not to kill at least one, somehow. Uh, they might move to Peleus, I don't think that we, they will, but uh, that's good. That's Speaking okay. of Peleus, I might as well. Yeah, yeah, might as well get the Steve out of the way. <laughs> he got further than he ever got in his life. Everyone kills him on the uh, south exit. Yeah. Peleus, yay! Strength! <laughs> oh. 11 sort number two. Oh, strength is actually AS, yeah. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, I guess that's not bad. Okay, so how about Oscar? Uh, you can... Okay, you can stole by the sniper. It's only because he's holding his javelin, probably? No, wait, no. Oh, he's got... What? Oh, he's got 16 speed. Okay. And he's got some crit, too. Um, 12 times 2. That's kind of bad. Maybe that's... Like, I don't really see a way that, uh... Like, gets rid of one archer without opening us up to the other archer moving first and dying and then the sniper. Oh, you're That's right. the issue. That is, a nice, that is an issue. Okay, I guess we can disengage then. So I'll Actually, unless we fire to him. If we fire to him, doesn't that work? Because doesn't fire to him fail to kill the other archer? That's true. Um, yeah. Oh, there you go. We could do that, actually. Okay, sure. I'll, I will fire this one. You fired. You fired. Open dark. Such a different way of playing this chapter. I love it. Uh, where's the bay? We'll have a physic on um, the drink. Mm. Up to 32, she's got like 20 magic, huge healing. Oh, and he's gross. Classic <laughs> Nime, classic Nime. Uh, looks like the sniper can also be isolated now. Uh, but the sniper has Oh, if we go to the one. east? Oh, yeah, true. Hmm. You can, you can just let him come for a turn, I guess, because yeah, 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 yeah. it'd be kind of scary to expose Bartra to this, uh, to this crit rate of 12. Alright, sure. Let's let's come in here with our Draco Knights and uh, be friendly to the snipers in our own way. We will embrace them lovingly, right? Yep, for sure. Come here. There's a juicy Lin target here. There's there's so much to do here. I swear. Marf, Betri, and Dorothy. Alright, is it reinforcement of clock yet? I don't think so. Uh, can we get a sword real quick? Yeah. Okay. Just in case we need like one damage somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's a reinforcement of It is. Here we go. All boy. All of them. All of them. We need out. <laughs> Thank you, Odin, for not suffering from success. The sniper did not move. Oh, he did. Okay. That's Ooh. the coward's move, though. Unfork knights. Oh, right. I guess he like thinks he can attack Odin, so... Yeah, I guess it's either that or... Well, that's pretty much all my explanation. Unfortunately, he saw Rosado's range and decided not to get in range of him. Oof. Uh, what about so Altanus? Where's my Gradivus? Or uh, not Gradivus, the other the thing. Yeah. yeah, the Gable. Uh, yeah. Where's my Gable? Reach and do a massive 15 damage with 40 HP. Snipers. This is why Wait, Sniper but, is good in this game. But, but, okay, imagine if she did that. 
would Odin then kill the sniper? Think about it, right? These are the important questions. Looks like <sighs> it. Almost. Wait, what? Almost. Almost. But almost isn't good enough. Yeah, we need uh, the, a little bit more. Is, is there a better weapon? Do we have like a silver lance or a forged? Uh... That was my silver lance. Oh, that was your silver lance. 13 oh. might. I don't think I have more than 14 might. I guess Har has. Let's see, Har has 27 attack. She's 23. But Hark doesn't reach. I guess. Uh, Wait, Hark were... Har can kill the. Hark can kill the. What's it called? The archer. And then Altena can chip the sniper. And then Odin can chip the sniper. Well, chip, you know. And then Rosado can come up with the javelin and finish it off. Ooh. Oh, if Rosado hits that hit, that's going to be clutch. Oh. I hope we have another Where's save my... point. I used the one here. There's another one no. somewhere. Where's my save point? Good question. I just want to know. Uh, hmm. I'm warp no, warping. I might as well just warp like a good attacker next to the sniper. Yeah, I know. Like, there's nothing else to do. We just hit all the hits. We, oh, Oscar has yeah. a javelin chip too, but that, Ooh, that's Oscar in the way does. of Odin, though. Yeah, that's getting hmm. interfering with the plan, TM. Also, I can't physic Odin and, and warp someone. That is not both possible. Yeah, yeah. We need to do the Odin physic. Uh, if I that guess fails, if... then what? What do we do? Well, if, if Rosado misses, he dies. So we just have to restart from there. Uh, I don't think there's another way to get the kill this turn. We don't have like a uh, like a forged lance that is like happens to be better, or no? Nah, I don't think so. I'm gonna check my combo real quick, but I don't think there is anything. Uh, anyone with less items, please? Thank you, Dorothy. Always useful, this character. Even like a 13 might on Silver Lance. How much might I like these horses layers? So a longbow. I don't think it does anything. No. Wait, how much on the stonks? Stonks. 10 might. So oh, okay, like, forget about it. It's like slightly stronger than steel. Slightly. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> ah, why do I have to put Har here at all 10 of that? I know, right? <laughs> So sad, so sad. Uh, we can... Okay, so... It's unfortunate. I was like thinking about surround strats, but they, re they require pretty much the same thing. I think we have to do a Coward's Wolf this turn. Mm. I'm afraid. Fair enough. Fire, this, Physic. Wait a little bit. Is there anything that we can do to like intercept these reinforcements earlier, or are we just gonna like camp them out in this fort? <laughs> I think uh, we have to get inside after all. Because, uh... I mean... Originally, I was going to have, like, bait people over here and walk over the ledge if they can't get to me, but uh, it's not looking great. Plus, I'm not sure what Alice's AI is right now. Oh, that, that was the uh, the Peleas plan? Or... Yeah, that was the Peleas plan. The, the, was, the, the, the plan I had to abort, like, turn one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, at least Nime is getting that staff XP, am I right? Uh, am I right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's get inside. Move our thief out of the way. Let's get our car a little bit closer and I'll take a little bit closer. And throws out a little bit further away so Dorothy can get inside. And okay, we need. Sorry, Maria, I did not bring a door key for you. Yeah, no. I guess Oscar's gonna have to go through the outside because if he goes back, he might run into the reinforcements at the wrong time. Yeah, I think he needs to just go this way. He's in this part of the map now. He can go to the save point. There we go. Oh, that's a good idea. I like that a lot. Let's go. I think there's like almost no enemies at the top anyway to go for him. Let's go there. I like it. Okay, Odin has enough luck to not get crit by the sniper. Somehow. Uh, oh, I guess he does still have 100 hit, even though he's, I think he's on a pillar. What the heck? Good unit. Pillar Best gaming? Team. Odin, dang! Oh my Odin goodness, dang. dude. Oh my god. We he's just stopped so the playthrough. We've clearly won. Like, I mean. <laughs> he's so good. All right, there's got to be something cute we can do with the, the horsemen, where they, we make them go for someone behind Gatri, and then they're locked in front of us. <laughs> Silver Sword 26, uh, so it's more like 22 on Gatri. So it's like seven times two. We can take two uh, calves. They all have swords, so that's good. Let's see, they're coming here. Can take calf plus horse? Yeah, calf is about the same attack value, so we can get some, uh, some lance rank. Yeah, he has, he are, he's going to get A rank soon, damn. Uh, I don't know if we can spare the HP, but it would be nice if we could. Uh, let's go kill this dude before he gets more annoying. Um, so Silver Lance plus Silver Axe from R plus Odin should be enough. Alright, 
Probably don't there. even need that much. We do this, and then use Altena, then we can use Odin to move up instead. Mm -hmm. Not be afraid. Let's go. Let's not get greedy here. Goodbye. Altena, show no, your FE4 growth. Okay. Oh, the oh. FE4 growth. True, true, true. Have we seen an Altena level? We've seen one. Yeah, it was very disappointing. <laughs> oh, okay. Unfortunately. Do we need a Maria soon or no? Mm, not necessarily need. It will. I think okay. the moment we recruit all of Maria, then um, I think at least start moving towards us. So yeah, trying to trying to recruit yeah. herself, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. So back to the classic. Everyone squeezes their way through this tube while waiting for Gatry to not die. <laughs> I guess we do need someone to help Gatry a little bit with like baiting one nomad guy. Yeah, do we actually need to? We we need to have him. We we, we need to give him some backup, right? Yeah, I'll give him some backup next turn. We're going up here, I wonder how Oscar does against the armor slayer guy. He probably has to do it for like one. If he just for one turn, twenty six times two, or more like twenty two times two, eleven times two. So he, he barely survives at the current HP he has. So he can help out with some chips somewhere, or do the save points. Yeah, and then just run away. Yeah. It, it should like activate the aggressive AI of the hero too. So Yeah. Uh, it'll be a while before we unlock that door. Okay, so how's Gatry's count? I, I know I checked it, but just double checking it now. Doesn't get doubled by the uh, generic Cavaliers. That's good. 10 speed. Okay, he, he doesn't get doubled by any of them. That's great. What about the these guys? They do 6 times 2. Okay. So... If the, the Cavs seem to move first. So I don't know if there's a way to actually get the guys behind him. Like, do the funny trick where the, they move first. Because the Cavs have the higher move? Yeah, that's And they move it. first, yeah. No, uh, they have the same move. No, they have the same move, yeah. And in any might... case, they move first. Mm -hmm. Unless they see a lethal. Or we've already used Rad. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> we have already used Rad. That's true. Uh, let's see. I don't think okay, so what if we just... What if we just basically do it anyway, right? And what I mean by that is, like, we basically, like, leave Gaytree here. Um, or, what can she open, like, the movement on the second cav? Like, the second and third cav and whatnot? Ah, oh, dang. Okay, this doesn't really work. Mm -hmm. I was thinking we just... We have a cav move, and then we have a horseman move. And then we just get them into that formation, and then we just kill the front cav and oh, yeah. move Gaytree up. But, you know, if the cavs are moving first, we're going to have three cavs and two horsemen behind. Or four cavs, maybe two horsemen behind. Well, maybe so like that won't even work. Maybe it'll end up working out. And if we don't, we can just have one cav get chipped down by Gatri, plus Dorothy, uh, plus whoever mm -hmm. else feels like participating. Like we can leave Nibe here, for example, and just visit the main group whenever we need to. We can't give Gatri the glue factory for like a huge massacre, right? Like that just we goes could, too many but it would cavs. We also massacre our own uh, glue factor. Also, it's on Oscar. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, never mind then. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's not coming. I'm afraid. All right, Odin here to help out. Uh, I guess we could aggro the hero now, and if we give one item from Odin to Oscar, uh, we can send it to Convoy, and then Rosado can promote indoors. Ooh, not bad. So, or, you know, item from whomever kills the hero, right? So. Yeah, it just has to be someone with a full inventory. Okay, so let's... In that case, we should probably physic Oscar. Did I move Nime already? I did not. Okay. I'm gonna leave Nime here. Uh, where's that other physics? Some thief, right? Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna give. I'm gonna have someone else take that physic later. Right now I'm gonna physic mm -hmm. uh, Oscar. I'm gonna fight. Get a little bit more HP in this group. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Go here. Oh, uh, if he goes up here to attack, Pelias can probably help out too. Well, not in that oh, spot, we should have thought about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah we should have thought about that. Yeah. Ah. Oh, well. Okay, it's fine. Uh, we're on our way. Uh, Draco Knights go ahead, including our 1 HP Har. And then Gatry stays here. Marth needs to go. I think everyone else probably needs to stay here, right? Unless uh, Rosado needs to be near Convoy. Yeah, Rosado has to be near Marth. So, yeah, he's going with him. Uh, I guess Bartre and I would I would like to go to the boss kind of. But Lin I'm a little bit concerned about this group's ability to like defending against the horse. No, we got Bart. We got it's, Gatry. It's, how do we? It's basically we Gatry, and then if he, if Gatry fails, no one else is going to help us here. Uh, yeah, but I'll leave Lin here to like get some horseman kills. Maybe I don't know. Gotcha. Uh, yeah. Take no, this Physic or Nime in case we need more uses, and then send Julian on his way, and Bartre towards the boss where the hammer will come in handy. Alright, here comes the hero. 
Doesn't have crit on oh, Oscar, fortunately. It's like goofy hero animations. All yeah. <laughs> Bloop. Okay, let's pay attention to movement order this time. I think I saw all the cabs move before the horseman, but I'm not 100% confident. But this is the this amount of damage that Gachi can take for like several turns without dying. All right. Okay. No longer gets held by horsemen, and that's a horseman. Oh my! Because oh they my see attacks. Because they see attacks. Where's Where's my Rosado? Don't creep me. Thank you. Oof. Don't creep me. Okay. The, the formation plan you talked about earlier can work now, though. We can kill yeah. one, and then we kill with like Nene, maybe, or yeah, that's always an option if we, this doesn't work out. Because I was thinking Dorothy into Gatry. into like Lin. Yeah, and then Lin stands here and does nothing. That's a little scary. It's fine. I mean, they don't know how to retreat, so we should be okay. Yeah, I'm gonna use the save point just in case, though. <laughs> yeah. We know that Odin survives the hero, right? Uh, no. Oh, um... It'll be fine. Uh, we just physic Oscar and pray, right? Yeah, we just uh, physic Oscar. Or, or even, like, warp someone up there. Who knows? I don't yeah. know. <laughs> yeah, I think Odin does live. Let's see, 26... 26, 16, 16, 16. No, he's 16. right. No. He dies exactly. Even at full HP, he does. Yeah. Okay, uh, maybe we shouldn't have saved. <laughs> I think, uh, we'll be okay, right? It's physical. Ah, uh, yeah, details, details. Details. Let me try. Is physical enough, save. actually? Let's, let's find out. It's a good thing we just saved, right? So. Yep. 24. 24. Uh, I have a sneaking suspicion that's like an exact kill again. Yeah, that's an exact kill. Uh, where's my volumes? I guess we need warp then. Warp Rosado up. Take one hit. Does Rosado double the hero now? Nope, not yet. Rosado uh, also dies, doesn't he? he no. Um, You're right, he doesn't. Yeah, barely doesn't. No, we have to warp. We have to warp uh, Rosado out. All the warps. Uh, I can't warp Rosado. We, should, we, we need to... Well, we need to do this plan, right? We need to try to do the whole... Like, that. that's the most important thing, is the Dorothy Lin attack into... Or the Dorothy... Gaytree into this Cavalier and then Lin. Like, that has to happen. Yes. Get in, Dorothy. Get in there. I mean, it looks pretty safe, to be fair. Like, this looks pretty it. safe. I don't know Wait, about actually, Gaytree, no. Gaytree dies, doesn't he? Uh, only a little bit. Oh, boy. That's he all died. it takes. It's yeah. 22. 7 times 2. Yeah, he kind of does die, actually. Cringe. No. no! Did I soft lock myself? Question mark. No, no, no. You're fine. You're fine. Oh. What we can do with a javelin instead of with a steel lance on that cav. Oh, smart. It's a bit riskier, but you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> to be fair, we did just kind of ship the save point without checking like any of the maps. So. <laughs> yeah, I was like, <laughs> before I do anything, let me just save so I don't. If I fuck it up, I can go back. It's like, wait a minute. Saving is out. like messing. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Porthia. I like this. Okay, so now Lin has to be the one going here, not killing the Nomad Trooper. So we'll go yeah. here. And she, you know what? Lin chooses peace with the Nomads. <laughs> yes. Right? It's very fitting. Uh, I don't have anyone to warp, though. Uh, you have Rosado. No, I, I can't warp Rosado. He's too far away. Well, you can... You can oh, move Rosado and yeah, then just warp him anyway, right? Let me just turn like, to your right. With the Songs uh, equipped, yeah. I would, I would, I would like no? to uh, have a turn here, but you know what? Emergencies. Uh, we go here then? Uh, actually, that doesn't quite work, because remember, he can use the ledge, so you need to move Oscar first and then warp yep. Rosado. You're right. Oh my god, spoilers. <laughs> Maria was not replaced. Um, so, go here, and then put Rosado where he was, basically. Right? Uh, yeah, yeah, Rosado where Oscar used to be. I could just do this, right? I guess so. Oh, that's, yeah, that's even better. Okay, let's do that. <laughs> okay, now we can just move everywhere, so we've got to stop him. Uh, Rosado with the stonks. Warped over here. Another beautiful Nime level up, I'm sure. Oh, what? What? Oh, wait, it actually kind of was. Okay, what? not bad. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, all right. Simple. Okay, Rosado will just get his own Master Seal. Uh, if I just moved like a little bit differently here, I could have had so much chip in this hero with Pelias. I'm sorry. Yeah, we could have like unloaded on this guy. Yeah. <laughs> like... Oh, well. 
Uh, well, Marth is right here, so we could trade a Dorky to these to get Maria free one turn earlier, but I mean, we still have to wait for Marth to get there in the first place, so screw it. Come here, Marv. Good old Marthy Marth. Marth. Alright, more reinforcements. Okay. Here's part two. Ugh. Ooh. Stonks time. Boink. All right, no one doubles anyone. We're choosing peace. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, what's that? No much we're doing. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, are you oh, um, oh, they, can they can they cross the cliff? I guess they think they can. So they probably I mean, can. if they think they can, they probably can. That's usually how computers mm -hmm. work, right? Like, yep. All right, I guess we get Oscar a promotion here or a promotion level, or I mean, Rosado deserves this one, right? He's got to have this one. Well, what if we promote this turn? Right. Oh, true. All right. I like your. I like the way you think. Get him, Oscar. Take him out. I just like the CHP he... is wasted anyway, right? Like, come on, we're fine. <laughs> yeah, uh, this HP. sucks. Okay. Master Seal. All right. <laughs> Rosado Stonks incoming. I didn't realize he was only level ten. I know, right? It's, it's I mean, like... look at these stats. Just ship it, right? Like, yeah. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, time to one round some uh, some rangers. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's so good. He's so good. Plus Look nine for the bulk. Look at him. Only minus three res. Still tanks oh, mages God. like crazy. Plus two move. <laughs> Plus two move. Yeah. Can you use axes? A rank axes. Wait. A oh no! It's you told me. Time. You told me he secretly had a rank axes this whole time. Yep. What? He's What's ready. He's in this unit. It's OP. <laughs> Someone make a stop. It's not fair. Can I get like Athos chapter one or something? Like, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna do the Dorky plan. I have to cite it. There you go, Maria. You're free. Poor I'm Maria. Not replaced. Yep. Unfortunately, not. No one remembered she was in her cell. Okay. Um, do we just keep this the way it is? I think we just heal Gatry so. for now, at least, like this. Yeah. Why not move Gatry and then heal? Do so we need him to the west? Um, I don't know. So, can you kill this guy? Unless we want, like, a different person occupying this tile. Oh, I guess we can kill with Lin and then put Gatri in place? Uh... Other way around. What if we... Okay, what if we moved Lin and then just, like, started shooting the... What's it called? The Cav. Oh, with, with Dorothy? Yeah. I like it. Let's go. It's free! <laughs> free EXP. The farm. <laughs> <laughs> the farm begins. I don't know if we can kill this calf with her, because then the other nomad trooper might see a lethal kill. But hey, here we go. A lethal yeah, kill. Yeah, no, as we opposed probably to can't do that. Kill. Yeah. An ordinary kill. It's like a Fortnite elimination? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, send... We gotta do something about these calves one day, though, right? Yeah, can Odin just kill this boss, or is there a javelin? Uh, there is a force javelin on him that he's not <laughs> equipped with, so it's not happening. But uh, we can get this armor knight the other way, at least. There you go. Yeah, Jarov is gonna... Counterattack as it looks like. Okay, they, they, can, they think, definitely think they can cross the cliff, and I think they're right about it. Are they right? Oh boy. It's I okay. mean, slowly, but it's they okay. can. Rosado was here. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, open this door next. Very reassuring to know that we have our fire. Uh, one square short. No. Come on, dude. Why did we move Martha here? Because I'm chippy XP. I'm sure, I'm sure at least we'll be happy about this. We could have moved Mars to the other square, even. We totally could have. Okay. Just watch out. I mean, Rosado does, like, wreck these, right? Mm, I think so. Right. But, like, Har can give her the pull axe, and then we can wreck them. Yeah, we can just do some trade shenanigans. Oh, watch oh, out for, oh, watch out for being in range of, uh, what's it called? Maria, or yeah. Elise. Yeah. Oh, is that just Elise's range? Oh, it is. Okay. Let's not do that then. Not for now. But we definitely get like Jim Helper out here. Watch out, like because you decided to uh, like cutely get some cheap like or uh, like some cute chip EXP on Maria. It turns out like you just get recruiter and now we're going to hostile. Who knows? Yeah. No, no <laughs> oh, trigger, no. right? That would be quite sad. Uh, I'm not sure if Oscar should be going this way, but I guess he's kind of okay against the uh, the guys on enemy phase, the the horsemen. We can give him Rosado's Vuln. He might be able to get more out of that than Rosado can. There we go. 
Do we need to like send someone over to this vendor and buy some bones, or can you just buy bones in prep menu? Uh, no, we actually do need to buy stuff. I'm gonna actually gonna leave that with Odin because uh, I will forget if I don't. There's a. I think this might be a hammer in the shop too. Yeah, yeah you said you wanted one for that. <laughs> Let's go. Wanted one for that bar tray. Yeah. I mean, maybe there's gonna be a point where the hammer's just like not very good. I don't know. Maybe yeah. not. Or you know, we save it until it is good again. Win win. How expensive can a hammer be anyway? Like you know. $80? Like, come on. Yeah, looks like Elise is quite unaffected. All right. My, he's so dashing. <laughs> All right, Brody has completely inferior to, to Makaya next. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but she can heal uh, Har. I'm not sure what Elise will do if I go up here and attack. What are the horseman ranges now? Still the same, right? These are the ranges. They're a little bit Do different. we need to, like, open up a uh, channel for Marth, right? Because at the moment, there's no way for at least to reach Marth. Yeah, that might and be. And is she going to try to reach Marth? So we should probably like make sure that the way is clear. Sure. Global we'll range is on. I'll just move my Dragonites over here. And the whole squad. And how does he do here? He lives. That's good. Mm -hmm. I think I'll save his HP for now. Let's make sure that. Marth can get through, I guess. So like this. There we go. Sounds Marth, good. That release, whatever. And let's keep on chipping. There we go. I love it when you get these formations. <laughs> yeah, it's great. I think she's still always going to be one on by these silver bows, though. Yeah, this, we're never escaping that. She has no chance of crit, right? Uh, Dorothy? Um, She has like a 3% chance, maybe. She'll be fine, mm. though. Yeah, she'll probably uh, just watch out when we get to that point. Odin shot. Welcome to my fell Sil storefront. storefront. Okay, we can't buy a hammer here. As well as silver axes if we want some. I think I might have bought one already. Oh, I didn't because it's not in a convoy. What is it? Oh, it's here. Gotta be lances and bows, right? Ooh. I don't know. Ooh. Ooh. It's disgusting. disgusting. Get out of my face. Fender. Larabelle. Bridge key. I don't think I'm buying any of this. Yeah, Maybe no. some don't, don't. Can't you I just master awesome. key the drawbridge? Yeah, I think so. I think I'll actually buy some bones. I think having some bones would be nice in combo right now. Maybe like another four or something. I don't know. Maybe They're 360 sure. gold, dude. I mean, come on. Just get like 10 of them. Yeah. Like, okay. But that's like an entire forge. Oh, yeah. Like, okay. <laughs> that's also 10 bones. Your point <laughs> being. Okay, stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. Yeah, just, just, just end turn with these units. See if there's anything I forgot. Doesn't look like it. Okay, looks like Elise doesn't move right away. Okay. Unless she does. Oh, Told there you. she comes. Hmm. She'll recruit herself, right? She's not going to attack me, right? Uh, she'll recruit herself. There's a bit of an issue, though. Is there? Uh, uh, kind of. No, we can just melee these guys, though. Yeah, okay, I was just going to wreck mind. these guys with the glue factor and uh, the, the Halberts. Uh... Sounds good to me. Are you by any chance to wait down? Nope. Unfortunately. Uh, so just glue factor this man. I think so. That one's easy. I think from here the most reliable way is try to have hard do Jim Halbert. Oh, Oscar's getting sick with that seven magic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we just Jim Halbert, and if we miss, we have a trade chain with Altaina where we can try it again. Yeah, yeah. Do or for crit. <laughs> or that. But I didn't you check know, if there's more reinforcements that can reach him this turn, but I don't think that there are. There's not. It's a six and nine. It says one. Okay. Well, what is never wrong, so it works for me. Yeah, no, never. Okay. Um, Marth, let's, uh, let's scare ourselves a little bit. This. This. No javelin here. Surely she recruits herself, yeah, right? I know it for sure, sure, but it's scary every time. <laughs> All right, let's get a new hammer here. I guess a silver axe for Har. That's true. We do need a new one. I probably should buy like one or two bad ones. All right. Oh, I didn't shoot with Dorothy, I don't think. That's Yay! Fine. She's Woo. here. We have a lease. We do. Finally. What a sweaty map this was. Yeah, no. That could have been much easier, but I made it hard for myself. All right. Unit review or? Yep, unit review. Is. Let's take a look at Elise. Should be up here. Yep. Submitted by Kirby Master. 
and uh, I was asked for her to have good, s low skill, high luck. That's at least that's uh, that's what he, what he wanted. So I think I took some liberties with her luck. Uh, this otherwise should be Elise a base reclass to Malignite in Conquest. So if you check Veil, for example, and just go at Veil Conquest Elise uh, one one Malignite or something, or just Malig, you, you get this minus the luck. Uh, luck is of course not the greatest stat in this game where it only gives half a void and everything else. Uh, so our hit rate shouldn't be too good in theory because of that awful four skill. Fortunately the hot player is a ridiculous weapon with 80 base hits but also 18 might, which anyone with AX can use, so Bartra can use it, um, Har can use it, uh, Basilio might eventually be able to use it if I use him a lot. So hot player will be quite good. At least I, I find the Draco Knights in this game, or so far in this playthrough, they're great, like the class is awesome, but the units are definitely not able to wreck just everything in sight. So I don't think Elise is broken or anything, but obviously 10 move with flights and axes, A rank axes at that, and even D rank lances is, is quite good. 10 speed is enough to at least not get doubled by a lot of enemies. 11 defense and 22 HP is enough to survive A hit, sometimes two if you have weapon triangle. And I mean, to be honest, 9 strength is good. I wish you could use her 14 magic, but there's absolutely no way in this game for her to use her magic besides the reclassing feature. So that part, I think, is just for show. And I guess we'll see how good a Malignite without magic really is in this game. Uh, I think Elise will be not as useful as Har and Altena have been for us so far, uh, but at least she can trade for that Jim Halpert every now and then. What do you think? Yeah, no, probably like trading the weapons. Right, it, it's so weird. Like she joins with the best tax in the game, and I'm like, the thing I want to do is like trade different weapons onto her and like have her use those instead. Like just have her use the effective weapons. I mean, the the four skills kind of dicey, I know, but I don't know. It's pretty funny. The the bulk is actually okay. I gotta say, right? Like a like this eleven defense, thirteen res, and I think I think it's pretty like fine and passable for the moment. The thirteen res especially is like pretty prodigious. Oh, I don't really remember much many like magic enemies coming up, but and I'm sure there's one or two. And we just saw Rosado take like minus four res or something. So she's probably your new go-to for that, <laughs> right? True. It, it, it's, it's pretty good. I like it a lot. Um, I don't know how long she'll stick around as opposed to, you know, say someone like Rosado. I mean, well, okay, that's really not fair to say. But for one, she's better than Altena and I think better than Har right now. So probably fine to stay for a bit. Yeah. We'll see. I didn't think of a res. Uh, yeah, Rosetta has 8, Altena has 0, and Har has 4, so she's definitely the highest res during that we have at least, and her HP is not that much worse than Har's. Wait a minute, um, yeah, she's just good. Har's got more good strength her. and skill especially, so we'll see how that, how that compare. I feel like Har with Hot Claire might sometimes be able to do better things, depending on what you want, of course. Uh, let's uh, send Martha over to that, that, that gate-shaped gate he's got to seize. Over here. Might as well heal a little bit with Maria. Gotta get that EXP in Maria, right? Yeah, she's definitely gonna be deployed a lot. Alright, uh, Gotta promote her. Done. I don't think I can really move. I can move like Barche maybe, but honestly, just give Elise the hammer for a second. Give me that, <laughs> yeah. Let me take care of that problem Nine. for you. Nine strength doesn't matter if you have this like 12 might weapon, right? Like yep. just attack him with it. <laughs> uh, should heal hard with Maria. Send Altena ahead. One. Princess of a wyvern country to another. That's right. Commit a war crime, I don't know. <laughs> yep, let's do some war crimes. Unarmed. No! Unarmed. I'm unarmed! Leave me alone! <laughs> uh, was I done shopping? I think he kind of was. I just want to buy some yeah. steel weapons. Unless he wants to like visit the lore house or something, I don't know. Yeah, I guess. Alright, visit the lore house. What do I have to yeah. say? It's three great magi in our world. Maloa, Garneth, and Goto. Now Maloa is gone. If only there was someone left powerful enough to stop Garneth. Oh, don't worry. Odin Dark is right Elise. here. That's right. <laughs> if only there was someone powerful. Powerful sorcerer. Powerful sorcerer. Yeah, let's get it, Marth. And then... Uh, you don't have a Rider's Bane, right? Just double checking here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Double no, just a Silver Lance. Get some Lance rank on him. Get the B rank, rank Lances. Uh, War Crime this guy. Paltry Silver Lance. Stop him from doing stupid healing on his armor knight. Tainal level? Alright, okay. Alright, equal strength to Elise. Just a bunch more HP strength. Though. More strength now, right? Uh, let's see, Elise is 10, right? Elise is 9. Oh, you're right, okay. 
All right. I can no longer say she's just better than Altena. Uh, I feel like yeah, I have four Draco Knights. <laughs> I feel like, let's see. Like, the the yeah, best one is definitely so Rosado. Cool. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, end of Altena, debate. Like, yeah, Altena has like Lance rank over them, which is the most interesting part. But that's like what Rosado has to. And Rosado just has all the ranks and all the stats. Yeah. Altena has Lance rank. You got to have Axe rank. Well, Rosado deserves everything, right? So, that's you know. true. That is true. All right, Odin might as well help out over here. Okay, nope. Uh, Dorothy XP. 4% crit. Or 3% crit. Yeah, when they get to below 12, then it's getting like kind of scary, but you know. Yeah. Just to make sure we can seize the throne, I guess. Yeah. Okay, Oscar. Oh, 15 damage. Do it again, do it again. <laughs> Alright, good formation. Dorothy, tankiest unit in the game. Easily. Odin Dank. Blood flames. Okay, so we haven't attacked with uh, Rosado a single time. After a single promoting. time. After promoting. After, okay, after promoting. I was about to be like, dude. <laughs> Here you go, Rosado. Have you forgotten? <laughs> Galley this combat. It's kind of good. Disgusting. Alright. At least you deserve this kill. This guy. Oh shit, that's some nasty hit rates. Let's just wait, I guess. Or... Let's just wait until like, everyone's in position and can fight him. Yeah. I don't think you can do anything. Nope, not yet. Nope. Alright, let's just amp here for a second. And maybe he'll switch to Silver Lance and then we can Odin Dank him for some more chips. If he, if he switches to Silver Lance, doesn't that kill at least? Actually, it probably doesn't, to be no, fair. No, because like, the javelin is forged, so it's only like a little stronger. Only two more. No, extra. only. Pfft. Yeah, come on, just send it. <laughs> okay, let's go. Now we can maybe finish with the Hot Flare afterwards for real story value. Archer catching up with the Draco Knights. Yeah, yeah, isn't there dialogue here? I have no idea. Uh, that's another good question. All right, he's still crit is not lethal yet. And before the guy is like healing AI, gotta run away. Bye, Dorothy. Ah. Yeah, whoops. <laughs> whoops. I mean, there's no fort, right? There's one up there actually. You'll not get past me, rebel. <laughs> Open his can. Bonk. Eighty-one with a forged hammer is pretty good for someone with four skill. Yeah, I mean, skill's like one to one, right? So, you know. Yeah. How bad can it be? This is a little scary, though. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, we can Odin now. Oh, Odin just kills him. I mean, is that bad? Probably not. Odin would like to promote too. Alright, maybe just. Yeah, I, I looked at Odin. He's like only level eight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somehow. I think it's because he one shots him. <laughs> yeah. Send it, Odin. Odin and Elise doing it together, that kind of makes sense too. Like, come on. They're yeah, friends. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're good marriage partners in fates. Here you go, exact say. level. Oh, true. Oh, Odin Dang! Oh my goodness! And the speed wing. And the speed wing? It's probably pretty good on him too. Every time he doesn't get doubled, we win. So now what, we just like attack with Dorothy until we accidentally crit and then we beef? Yeah, basically. We can, we can try to send up something funny with uh, Gatry, I guess. So Marth is in seat rank. We can just leap whenever we want. So let's, yeah. let's see what we can get on Dorothy. Uh, I guess we could... No, nah, it makes more sense to milk him for all he's worth. Take this guy out. There we go. Yeah. Actually, the guy be... The guy in front of her is weak, too. Because if we send, like, a kill here, we could kill with, say, Nime, and put Gatri in front of her again. Right? Directly? Theoretically, I guess? I don't know. I'm not seeing it. It's just a game theory. Like, look. It would be... Okay, well, let me turn off auto scroll first of all. Okay, okay. Dorothy... Okay, so Dorothy kills... I guess Nime would have to, like, not miss. If she misses, she dies to the Nomad. Oh, yeah, that'd be kind of inconvenient. Yeah, I mean, she's old, but I don't think she wants That's to... That's pretty bad, yeah. That's pretty bad. This is not a kill. It was just Javelin, yeah. Well, yeah, if I Javelin, he doesn't die. So, yeah, but we get in uh, Gage for EXP, like we might as well just do it, right? Oh, in that sense. Yeah, I get it. Okay, fair enough. Just don't get We, could, we could get double 1% crit, yeah. Yes. 
He was teasing it. Okay, I guess we just tease. <laughs> yeah, all right, cool. Get out of here. Nice try, everybody. It was a good try. Well, I've never heard of him. Pontifex Monsell? I don't know. Yep. All right. That's going to be it, everyone. Thanks for watching right. this long, dreadful, reset-heavy episode. And we'll see you <laughs> next time for some Norda Market. Goodbye. See you next time.